Well, nights like these are just what you hope for as a spectator. A warm welcome. I'm Derek Ray, and joining me for commentary is Lee Dixon. And getting ready to bring you this European Championship group stage game. It's Portugal versus Germany. Well, thank you, Derek. The excitement at the start of any game is almost tangible. Looking forward to this one. The crowd are up for it. Players look like they're going to have a really good go at this game. Can't wait. The lineup for the home side. If you like wingers, you'll love this league. Yeah, absolutely. I love to watch a winger play, especially with pace and power. The central striker will stay more or less in front of the goal. The support will be provided by the three central midfield players. The back four is pretty conventional, but the fullbacks will be asked to support from behind. This is the lineup for the visitors today. Manuel Neuer gets the nod in goal. Mats Hummel starts alongside Matthias Ginter in central defence. Toni Kroos plays alongside Ilkay Gundogan in central midfield. And rather than use a strike partnership, they've gone with just the one player in attack. And the game begins. Loves to attack from the wide areas. Chance to cross. Danilo Pereira. And when you analyse this, Lee, you just feel that all attacking roads ought to lead to Cristiano Ronaldo. Well, basically, you've got to keep him out of the box because he's got such a brilliant finishing ability that you give him half a yard, he will score. So keep him as far away from your goal as possible. Rudiger. It's with Robin Gosens. Danilo Pereira. Mats Hummels wins the challenge. Gundogan. Havertz. They do pass the ball with authority. Well, that's really sound goalkeeping, not letting the opposition have any scraps. And a throw in it's going to be. How about the cross? Well, a bit of an unforced error, and it's going to be a throw. Bruno Fernandes. Diogo Jota. It's with William Carvalho. Danilo Pereira. Well, couldn't keep it. William Carvalho. Bruno Fernandes. And the advantage accrues to the attacking side. Pepe. Now with Danilo Pereira. Just couldn't get it through. Thomas Müller. Well, possibilities in the centre. He read the situation defensively and did his job. And a free kick awarded by the referee. Well, no card, but the referee making it clear next time there will be one shown. Gozens. I well, just couldn't keep the ball. Diogo Jota. Well, they couldn't keep possession.
looks as though he's alone in the centre. Saved, but still a chance. Danger averted for now. Cristiano Ronaldo. Ronaldo. William Carvalho. On to Ronaldo. William Carvalho. Oh, he's given it. Penalty. And an opportunity now for them to jump in front. Well, that could be his final rebuke, I think. And the referee's making that absolutely clear. Well, I like that, Derek. Good refereeing. Nice and strong. Told the player exactly what he was thinking. Oh my word, you can miss a penalty in all sorts of ways, the keeper can save it, but to hit it over the bar. And the fourth official confirming that we'll have one additional minute. William Carvalho. Well, the managers will now deliver their half-time team talks. We're at the end of 45 minutes in this game. As anticipated, plenty of talking points so far. And now the second half is underway. Gundogan. Thomas Müller. Ginter now with Havertz Gundogan well we always like to assess how things are going for Cristiano Ronaldo a case of could do betterly well no goals for him no real chances either he needs to help his team a little bit more just to get involved in the game I think he would be the difference if he was playing better wonderful block Kimmich, Gnabry, using his physical strength to shield it, far from a good pass. You can't really tackle like that and expect to get away with it, booking to come you would think. And the referee decided that intervention was illegal and cautionable. Oh, without question, it was not the best of challenges. Timo Werner Kai Havertz well only just wide of the post let's get the latest on the injury situation from our pitch side man Jeff Shreves he seems to have taken a blow to his upper thigh but there's no sign of him being replaced yet cheers Jeff They could really get at the opposition. Teammate available and able to close down the shots. He's protecting it effectively. Havertz. Werner. Bruno Fernandes. And across the touchline, so a throw in here. We're now inside the final 20 minutes of the game. It did look as though they might be onto something for a second or so. Joao Felix. Can they create something from here? Bruno Fernandes. Well, a top-notch piece of defensive judgment. Surely 
Mats Hummels with that important block. Well, the fans haven't had much to cheer about, have they? But a goal here would be huge. Over it comes. And not an attempt he'll be terribly proud of. Oh, lovely weighted ball. They might be in. William Carvalho. Strong but fair tackle. Trying to get onto the front foot with the minutes ticking away. Sané. And Kimmy. Gundogan, a real opening now, this is why we adore this game, late drama, and now they're in front. Well it looks like the game is over, but no, there's another chance, and there it is, back of the net, it looks like the winner. Well I can tell you Derek, when I got into this position it was panic stations, hit it as hard as you can, but that's a lovely, lovely controlled finish, in step, in the goal. Well, a dramatic moment near the end, and that might well be the decider. The players are using this energy from the crowd to drive them forward time after time to get back into this. Danilo Pereira. Inside the final two minutes of this contest. Gundogan. Zane. Well, totalling up all the stoppage. Oh, in with a chance! Müller! And a goal! The quick one too, And they've turned this game on its head! Well, here it is again. And he starts with the ball over the top. Perfectly weighted. And once he gets himself settled with the keeper to beat, he hammers it into the back of the net. Smashing goal. Well, his players have followed his every command and some. The coach must be delighted. Well, a second goal for them here. And that's it for tonight. Full time and an encouraging start for them. Three points from their initial fixture league. Well, it's everything you want from the start of match one. Good, strong start. That result will give everybody confidence, especially the players. Well done. Dominant display by Tony Kors this evening, Lee. Well, that was a really, really good performance from the lad and a goal to boot. Really delighted with that goal, I'm sure he is. the game.